This is David. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just come and stand this side. That's right. Um, yeah, so I was out with Yabani and I thought, you know, I'm the man, show a bit of courage, lead off. So um, we approached a guy on a bench and he said, um, I'm sorry, I don't want to talk about my faith. So Yabani was then sort of moving towards this woman at the bus stop and I thought, she doesn't look interested. So I said, come on Yabani. We went over to two other guys sitting on a bench and I kicked off and one of them said, I think you're being very rude. Um, asking us these questions. So at that point I thought, hmm, maybe I should let Yabani lead rather than me. So Yabani led off back to this lady she'd wanted to talk to in the first place, Lillian. She was a lovely woman, really open. We, we shared the love of God with her. Um, we went through the scriptures. Um, she, uh, she, well, we prayed for her, then she prayed the prayer and gave her life to Jesus. So, <laughs> And so I thought, right, Yabani, you go and I'll follow. Yeah. So <laughs> we then approached a couple of people at the bus stop under Yabani's leadership. And um, this guy, Robert, and his partner, Muriel, and he was actually helping to arrange a friend's funeral. He was, again, a lovely guy. And we talked to them for a good time. And God kept the buses from coming, which was great. Um, and again, he was so open. We shared the scriptures with him. Um, we, uh, we prayed for him, again he prayed the prayer, he gave his life to the Lord, it was absolutely, I gave him my phone number, um, hoping he'll get back in touch with me, it was great. And then we went, went to another one, another guy, and I thought, well I'll lead again this time, went up to this guy on the bench, I said, uh, started talking to him, he said, I'm sorry, I don't want to talk to you, and he walked away. So, that was my morning, it was absolutely brilliant, praise God. Praise God, <laughs> thank you. Amen.